Check it out, folks. Check out our build. We just did. Look here. Two truck rotors, a bunch of steel, a bowling ball, a four-ton jack, a pitman arm. Look at all this. All right, you press this pedal. That loosens the top here. Position this wherever you want it. You press this pedal, and then you jack it back up. And then it's tight right there. We still got to epoxy this in, but uh, that thing is pretty awesome. Build is coming up. We did this in five hours with about 40 bucks of junk. Switch me places? Well, I mean, I was comfy there. I got a challenge for you, Jeremy. What time is it? It's like 6 o'clock? What the heck? This ain't pull apart. <laughs> it is 6.15. When you gotta be home? I mean, I don't have to be home, but my dogs would like to be walked before midnight, bro. Okay, he needs to be home at midnight. Hold on, this is... Let's see if we get out, like, I'm like an hour drive away from my So we have to do this before then. Bowling ball? A bowling Oh my god, we gotta make the clamp? What do you think? We're gonna make the freaking two rotor clamp deal? The welding table? The welding table, the device? He figured it out. I thought it would take him longer. Well, I was the one that sent him the link to the thing like four years ago. Four years ago? A long time ago. That goes like that. This goes like this. You have a clamp here, and you can put whatever you want to weld in there. Just say you got these or something, and you want to weld them at a certain angle. You can take your clamp when it's here and slide it all the way over like this. So your piece is now here, and then when you get done, you just slide it back over and do that. And you never undid your clamp. All you undid was that clamp. All right, so we have four hours. You think we can do it? Do you have the clamp or are we using the vise? No, no, no. So instead of a vise on the top, it'll be just a flat surface. Okie doke. That, I understand that. Let's do it. I like it. Challenge accepted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's my idea. Let me know if you have something else. So you have this stand, right? The top rotor is actually welded in place. You cut the top out of it. And then the bowling ball goes here. And then the bottom rotor sits kind of inside this area. And the jack is underneath that. And then there's like a foot pedal. Let's see, kind of like this. A little foot pedal for jacking it up. And then there's another foot pedal for releasing. And then out of the top here, you have a table that sits like this and then of course you've got two more legs so i'm concerned if you have a rod sticking up through the middle that your throw is only going to be like that before it hits the road on either side that's well, my thought we're so going like, to cut we can yeah cut. we can cut all that but that's still not a lot it's just going to be suspended on a rod probably no bigger than this pin it's for welding little tiny objects, not for welding Engine axles. box or something. <laughs> <laughs> I understand that. We need to make it heavy duty. Here's my metal selection at the moment. I've got some square. I've got some flat bar. First, got angle some angle. We might angle could use would be best. angle for the uh, legs. That's way too skinny. You need that big step, like an inch and a half. I don't think we've got enough. Yeah, you got two pieces there. That's probably right. half. Is that gonna think work? Then there's another piece. That'd be two of the legs. I think there should be a square frame probably on the bottom of that. And then these legs come into each corner on the square frame. Why not just weld it directly to this? Well, that's like a pot metal jump. I'm not saying you can't, but this is not gonna be great to weld to. Well, remember we're not gonna be hammering on it. It's just for like tig welding. Bull! We're just, gonna be beating on this thing. It's just for tig welding. But still. Okay, let's see. I've got, uh, or I've got this uh, double D. If we drill a hole, how are we, we gonna epoxy that in? You got any epoxy? I do have epoxy. Oh, snap. 
Yeah, but this double D's got, it's gonna be stronger than that. You like the double D's, don't you? <laughs> That's completely on square. I told you, it sucked. Did you move it? <laughs> what did you do? What the heck? He's saying funny stuff over here, and I told him he's gotta let me know so I can start recording before he says funny crap. Look at this piece of junk. You gotta <laughs> tighten the nut on the bottom of the bolt? I told you that's why I didn't want to use it. it Suck. You need to weld something on the bottom of this nut. We need to stop that project and fix this one. That's gonna have a lot of throw because it's actually down further now. Yeah, it is. So it'll come way over. The problem is it's gonna hit this other one. Now th this doesn't rotate. I keep thinking that this is rotating. This, the only part that rotates is the ball. Possibly we weren't thinking. What are we building, Jeremy? I thought it was a vice. You say it's a table. Who knows? <laughs> I drew you a map. Yeah, I know. But it was on a whiteboard or something. Like Redneck. This is slightly too large. What's a bowling ball made out of anyway, do you know? Rubber bands, like a golf ball. <laughs> no. <laughs> Rubber bands. <laughs> this is too big too. What if we don't have a big enough drill bit? I do have drill bits. Do I have drill bits with me? <laughs> what are you talking about? You've got the world's biggest auger bits. Those are huge. Uh, there we go. What's that? I got a tap. Hey, there we go. 31 30 seconds. Blow it out first. It might be a little dusty. <laughs> I've got welding gloves. Are they kid size? Big Bertha. Oh yeah. Whoa. What did you think was gonna happen there, boss? Here is my springs. I think if we put that there, it'll push it back up for our little plant. You're gonna need to put about. a spring on the pedal. It pulls mm -hmm. the pedal back up. No, dude. Why are you being a negative Nelly? I'm not. Facts, man. State the facts. Yeah. Check out, check out how cool that is. That's ghetto. Hey, does it work or does it work? It got jammed. I think there's a jamming problem here. This is the bottom of that, so that's somehow that's that has to go, go like that, that, which actually goes upside down. Keep in mind, it actually goes the other way. Jeremy says when you're cooking a pizza, just to add, don't preheat and add, what, two minutes, you said? Every time I don't preheat, the uh, pizza just falls right through the dang the dang grate and just is all over the bottom. So get the DiGiorno out of the oven, peel it open, slide it in there, look at the back of the package. It says 17 to 19 minutes. I put it down there on the 19 minutes. 10 minutes, we're gonna find out. You just, did you put the box in there and stuff too? Because that's not <laughs> end well. Don't, you can't say that. <laughs> you, you can't say that. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I, oh. Whoa, that sucker. It was on there. What happened? I don't know. It was already on there. So I just left it. How are the legs going to go on? I think we weld them right there. And then it'll hold 
this bottom piece in because you'll have four and this will be able to slide up and down inside there. Right? Yeah. Uh-oh. Dude! You got one job, man. Keep the guy working alive. This is about as square as our pavilion. <laughs> 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 I told you that. Come on, come on. I need to move. Come on, come on. These are our options. <laughs> Yahtzee, look at that. Maybe we need to custom design a stool that's the right size for this thing. That's too short. Definitely. You can't say that either. <laughs> there you go. I think that'll be perfect. Did you fart? It was, it was kind of this white acrylic oh, stuff. Oh, that stuff stinks. Oh. That's like poo. Is it, is it compost? You hit some kind of other layer in there. What, is it wood? Dude, it's like wood. Tell me that ain't wood. Not wood? All right, who knows what a bowling ball is made out of? Leave it in the comments below. Rotten right. freaking mulch, man. Rank wood. Like a glove. Sweet. Well, you're not gonna, damn, we ain't epoxying it tonight anyway. Yeah, we are. We gotta get this done. Done, son. Okay, let's mark it. <laughs> no, hold on. We need a. We need what? A, uh, what? You said let's do it. We're doing it. We need a bench to be able to sit down. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> 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 oh, God. I want my open piece to be right about here, I think. That's where the mark's at. The good part is it doesn't matter if it's crooked. This is true. Uh. Mm. So cool. It looks like some kind of weird ass lamp. <laughs> like a steampunk, garage welded, <laughs> bowling ball, trophy holder. We could put lights on it and have them wrap around yeah, the side. Yeah, like have a bowling ball trophy right here. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Stanley Cup, bro. Think about it. <laughs> if you're gonna weld to that, you probably need to take that all the way out. No, we'll just weld it slow. It'll be fine. What kind of foot pedal do you got? Don't jack it up too much. The whole thing's gonna <laughs> Bowling ball go flying everywhere. <laughs> How did Matt and Jerome die? Brake rotor exploded <laughs> at eye level. <laughs> <laughs> it's like looking at the pool here. Oh, look at that. A pitman arm? It's got the right drop and everything. Stomp, stomp. Before you even. <laughs> That's it, bro. Boom! Feet. Feet? Yeah. You weld this to the bottom of here, and then these adjustable feet. Yeah. Squeak, 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 squeak. Make sure I don't weld it on like that. <laughs> okay. Look. Look, this is the tighten side and the loosen side. No, we it just tightens make it. more than that. It had to come up like a That's V. That's what I'm here. saying. You bend it. You bend it in a V, 
tighten, loosen. That's not a bad idea, but that is too flimsy. Let's see your red. Oh, I don't know. Here. I said I said needle nose, but I don't see any needle nose around. You're adding to the cost <laughs> again. Mm -hmm. I don't this care. Is a, hey, this, this, this is not is a, my money. A $14 This edition. is like working for the government right here. It doesn't matter. That is so janky. <laughs> it's perfect. Think about it. Jeremy's falling asleep over here. It's like past, almost 11. It's past his bedtime. Some of us have normal jobs. All right. This is the closed position. If I weld that right there and then crank it over over here, uh-oh. It's bottoming out down there. See? Is that not tight? I think it's time to jack it up. It's going up. There he is. Oh, ho! <laughs> Who's your daddy? <laughs> <laughs> it's the simple things in life. <laughs> yeah. Yahtzee. Jack it up. Is it tight? Can you move the top? Okay. Now hit that lever. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Hell yeah! Okay, we started at 6.15. It is now 11.15 in the evening. Almost 11.15. And what's that, five hours? Five hours. We built this in five hours. That's including eating a pizza. Uh, we also uh, stopped to, uh, what did we do? I took a siesta for about four and a half minutes. <laughs> oh, and filmed. We did a lot of filming. Uh, a lot of moving the camera around. A lot of going back and forth to get batteries because one of my cameras crapped out on me. Are you ready? I gotta do this super. Super get up? Yeah, I was gonna say something else, but. <laughs> <laughs> Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! There it is. Okay, check it. Show me how it works. Watch it not work, that'd have been fun. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, pimping. You get it where you want it, you push that side, and then you push that a few times. Now it's clamped, you want to loosen it, hit that side, put it where you want it. Voila. It's actually really cool. I could imagine actually doing like repeat parts or something, or making a watch or something. And then, how many pumps? About three pumps on that. Maybe one, two, two pumps on that, tightens it down. I still need to epoxy this in here so that it doesn't spin. Although, we we're debating whether or not to have it spin. But in reality, the bowling ball itself will spin yeah. if it is epoxy down, so. I think that'll be better because if you have a heavy part on there and you go to turn it, it's just going to want to fall down to that side. Probably steel would do it, but you'd have control like, then. Like this. Like that. You don't want that to happen while you're welding. For a five hour project, it's something we've talked about, I don't know, a couple times ever since you you saw the other video, I saw the other video. I don't remember what that guy There's made. one video online from like 2006 or something and it's just a minute long video of this guy working with one of these and it has like 2 million views or something. But uh, we put the feet on so the feet are adjustable and what else? Oh, how much do we have in this? I paid $6 for the bowling ball. Everything else was just lying around except for the jack I paid. Uh, and that's a Pittsburgh heavy duty four ton. I paid like $14 I think for the jack, something like that. So. Metal probably got, I don't know, $35 of metal. Maybe 50 bucks all together in five hours, so. Yeah, it's actually been a fun build. <laughs> that has been fun. Let us know what you want to see next.
maybe we'll do another challenge. We only have about five hours at a time. Whoop! Say something. Last beer of the night. <laughs>